Top 10 Places to Visit in Italy Welcome fellow travelers to Wander World Travel Explorations. Today we embark on a journey through one of the world's most enchanting destinations, a land where history, art, and cuisine converge to create an unforgettable tapestry of experiences. Join us as we uncover the top 10 places to visit in Italy, each offering its own unique charm and allure. 1. Venice Where to start with La Serenissima? Even if you're not here for the Biennale or Carnival, this city positively hums with good vibes all year round. It has beaches, some of the world's best art, and we don't know if you've heard about the food here, but it's properly great too. Above all, Venice calls for getting lost, so avoid the touristy gondola rides and wander aimlessly along the alluring back streets, with regular stops for Prosecco and Sicchetti, of course. 2. Florence Sure, there's the Duomo and Michelangelo's David, and the Uffizi and the Ponte Vecchio. Florence positively brims with headline attractions that are well worth visiting, but there's so much more to this city than just the tourist magnets. For example, some parks that rarely feel busy, quirky museums that'll give you the creeps, vintage shops and second stores galore, and delicious gelato that'll have you mumbling benissimo under your breath all day long. Florence isn't a Renaissance theme park, it's a living city with plenty to seduce visitors of all tastes. 3. Sorrento and the Amalfi Coast Italy's stupendous Amalfi Coast, overlooking the Bay of Naples, is probably best known as the production hub of Limoncello, that sweetest of digestivi, made with lemon rinds, water, sugar, and of course alcohol. There's a generous sprinkling of beautiful towns along this 50-kilometer-long stretch of coastline, but Sorrento is the true highlight. With its sun-drenched piazzas, breathtaking hotels, and winding streets that ooze older world charm, it's a beautiful, manageably-sized town that'll turn any trip into a seafood-filled, Aperol-soaked dream. 4. Lake Como Italy has its fair share of dramatic scenery, but nothing can quite prepare you for the moment you first set eyes on Lake Como. An impossibly turquoise, wishbone-shaped lake, flanked by the Alps, and with shores lined by palatial villas and pretty towns, this long-time escape for the well-to-do has to be seen to be believed, while a handful of Lake Como's famous villas house luxury hotels, many are open to the public, including the exquisite Villa Balbianello, made famous by Casino Royale in Star Wars. Our tip? Pay a visit to the popular towns of Bellagio and Varenna, but stay in the city of Como for a wider range of budget-friendly accommodation, and try the Misoltino. 5. Trieste The writer John Morris once described this port city as the capital of nowhere. Once you're here, you'll see what she meant. Over the past 200 years, Trieste has been occupied by the Habsburgs, French, Italians, Yugoslavs, and was once an independent city-state. It may be Italian again, but you wouldn't know. The architecture is Oso Grand Budapest Hotel, while menus feature hodgepodge dishes like gnocchi al goulash. Slovenia is only seven miles away, and traditional osmiza will lay on fresh farm produce for walkers en route. Best of all, you'd be hard-pressed to spot a single other tourist. 6. Rome With world-renowned art collections and a shit-ton of history on pretty much every corner, Rome is a rite of passage for history buffs. But while you might come here for all the ruins, it's also worth a trip if you're properly into your cutting-edge food and drink, or just like a really good slice of pizza, TBH. Add to this the allure of its many verdant parks, with their beautiful panoramic terraces and a moderate climate that's inviting during any season, and it'll become far too easy to fall in love with the Italian capital. Seven, Naples, charming, Bujapaj, rundown Naples, once a rogue and dangerous Italian city to be avoided, is in the midst of a grand revival. Back on the map thanks to the success of Elena Ferrante's Neapolitan novels and Roberto Saviano's crime saga Gomorrah, plus the international TV adaptations of both, travelers who once would have bypassed this rough-hewn city are flocking here in droves, and yet, it still kept much of its character and old-world charm. Laundry laces the back alleys, 
markets brim with sweet-smelling local produce, and life here is lived on the streets. 8. Sardinia Sardinia ticks a lot of different holiday boxes. Beach bunnies will fall the head over heels for the white sands and impossibly aquamarine water around Costa Smeralda and the island's south coast. Nature lovers and hikers could wander for days around the interior, which feels like it hasn't changed for centuries. And foodies can also spoil themselves with some of Italy's finest produce and gorge themselves silly on seafood. Whatever kind of getaway you're after, there are plenty of idyllic accommodation options ripe to make yours a truly perfect stay. Nine, Bologna. Famed for its swelteringly hot summers, radical left-wing politics, picturesque terracotta buildings and all that food, glorious food, Bologna could well be one of Europe's most underrated city break destinations. In fact, the food here would be enough of a draw in itself. The capital of the Emilia-Romagna region is the home of mortadella, tortellini, and tagliatelle al ragù after all. Grab a gelato for dessert and make the pilgrimage to the sanctuary of the Madonna di San Luca, just beyond the ancient city walls. 10. Ischia A volcanic beauty sitting in the Bay of Naples, Ischia is an island that does both. It's big enough to justify spending your entire vacation there, yet small enough that you could feasibly see the whole thing in a week. Spend your days exploring coves, grottos, beaches, gardens, and rugged hills. Spend your nights dining in upscale restaurants in the bustling areas of Forio and Ischia Porto where boats bob on the marina and ferries offload holidaying Napolitani. Best of all, while Ischia certainly attracts summer crowds, it doesn't yet feel overcrowded, particularly in comparison to neighboring Capri. Do yourself a favor and visit now, and rent a moped if you want to do it right. As our exploration of Italy's wonders draws to a close, we hope these top destinations have ignited your wanderlust and inspired dreams of unforgettable adventures. Whether you're captivated by ancient history, mesmerized by Renaissance art, or enchanted by culinary delights, Italy beckons with endless opportunities for discovery and exploration. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to Wander World Travel Explorations for more captivating travel content. Until we meet again on the road less traveled, may your journeys be filled with wonder discovery, and the magic of Italian charm.